In a heartbreaking twist, Jamie Foxx's well-being has taken an unexpected turn for the worse, leaving his devoted fans deeply concerned. However, amidst this troubling situation, speculation and blame have surfaced, with one name consistently at the center of attention, none other than Puff Daddy himself. The rumor mill began churning when social media caught wind of Jamie's sudden hospitalization, shrouded in secrecy, fueling the curiosity of his eager followers. Puff Daddy is the king yeah. of deception. Yeah. Every time we was in the party, oh, he was throwing his champagne, his, his vodka in every picture. He was eating his, his, so we didn't know. We like, yo, he's a great guy. This is a great party. This is a great, yo, give me your clothes. I'ma rock it in the video, yo, 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 yo. John John sold 400 million. Champagne, this, 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 this. this. Boy, the joke's on us. Yeah. He been doing this for real. Yeah. We can't be mad at him. We always gotta use him as inspiration. Determined to unravel the mystery, we donned our metaphorical detective hats and embarked on a quest for answers. Initial speculation regarding Jamie's health struggles being linked to substance abuse quickly dissipated, given his impeccable clean image. However, further investigation revealed a shocking revelation. Jamie's injuries were not accidental, but the result of a deliberate and sinister act, a planned assault. The visible wounds on his face and neck indicated a fierce resistance, contradicting a simple accident. At that time, Puff was the biggest guy in the world. You know, you couldn't even get in this party. So the way I would get in this party is I show up with the camera. My camera said, yo, Puff, yo, you gotta let me film this. The whole thing, we need to document this playboy. He was like, it's here. And it's all about him. And I'll never forget, he got mad at me. So Jamie Foxx suffered a very serious medical emergency that landed him in the hospital. Too many. Diddy emerged as a central figure in this drama. The feud between Jamie and Diddy originated from Diddy's extravagant parties, which had spiraled out of control. Jamie shared a video detailing the humiliation he experienced at one of these gatherings, shedding light on improper activities. So I followed him the whole time. I remember watching Puff at the Beverly Hills Hotel, filming this, and it's a pool party that it's Moreover, Jamie exposed the excessive extravagance of Diddy's parties, exposing Diddy's desperate attempts to conceal unsavory secrets. These revelations unveiled a darker side to Diddy's events, with rumors of unethical practices spreading among other celebrities. Yo, Playboy, this party costs a million and a half dollars. So I'm like, you are out of your mind. And I said, Puff, I'll throw you a party for 400 bucks. So, yo, Puff, yo. You gotta let me film this, the whole thing. We need to document this, Playboy. Consequently, many rappers now distance themselves from Diddy, wary of his alleged involvement in unspeakable deeds. Jamie Foxx violated Diddy's strict rule against filming or recording at his gatherings, unknowingly inviting trouble. The tension between them escalated, leading to icy glares and snide remarks exchanged in a silent war. Jamie voiced his grievances with Diddy on social media, which only worsened the feud. The situation culminated in Jamie's hospitalization, though his injuries were minor. Fans speculated about Diddy's potential involvement, considering his reputation for dealing with those who cross him. There were discussions dispelling drug use as the cause for Jamie's condition, with commentators pointing out his clean record and allegations against Diddy. Diddy vehemently denied any wrongdoing, but given his past controversies and the lawsuit filed by his former chef, doubts arose about the credibility of his denial. The deaths of Diddy's rivals, like Biggie and Tupac, also added to the skepticism surrounding his character. Fortunately, Jamie Foxx is alive and recovering from his recent ordeal. Source tells us that he's communicating now. Yes. Which. If you're unable to communicate, that's something major. His daughter, Corinne Fox, confirmed his well-being on Instagram, providing reassurance to his devoted fans. While the specifics of his medical complications remain undisclosed, reports indicate positive signs, including his ability to communicate. Jamie was hospitalized on Tuesday, prompting his family to rush to his side. Despite limited information about the severity of his condition, the fact that he is making progress in his recovery, even if it's limited to communication, offers hope.
Fans and fellow celebrities have expressed their love and support, with Kerry Washington, LeBron James, and Garcelle Bova among those sending prayers and well wishes on social media. However, despite the overwhelming support and virtual embrace, it remains doubtful whether those expressing their solidarity through social media can shield Jamie from Diddy's wrath. After all, his hospitalization wouldn't have occurred if protecting him were as simple as posting well wishes online. With that, we conclude our report for today. Until next time, farewell, everyone.